school was but okay oh my god I am so freaking oh sorry I'm gonna tweak this a bit yeah. I am so freaking hot in this it is dying and the thing is I can't take this shirt off until I take the mask off so I'm like no screw you stupid freaking complications okay so today was day three of supernova or day two however you want to look at it but it's my day three because um I went all three days, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, so it's my day three. And today was meh, <laughs> meh, meh. Um, I had my photos taken by so many people, they kept coming up to me and going, can I take your photo? I'm like, okay, let's do this. And I don't know where they're gonna go because I haven't seen those photos. I don't know who took them. So that's gonna be fun. Yay! Um, so I bought out Gemini, Bat Dance, Half Joker, Half Batman, whatever you wanna call it. This morning I did the cosplay parade, which is walking from like the park up to the convention center, which is awesome. It was hot, like wearing pleather in the heat at like 7, 8 a.m. I never wanna do that again. But you know me, I won't listen to myself. Hmm. <laughs> um, so. That was fun, and then I got bored at the convention center, and I went to, actually, it was like a few minutes after we were allowed in the convention center. I was like, I'm too hungry for this. I've been up since 2 a.m. I ate at like 5. I need food, and it's like 10 o'clock or, or almost 11, and I'm starving and I'm thirsty, so I ducked to Woolies and grabbed some food, and on my way to Woolies, uh, I kept getting stopped, and people were like, can I take your photo, can I take your photo, can my kids have a photo with you? I'm like, yeah, sure, I don't care. Go for it, you know. I don't know if I'll bring this out in, in a hurry, but go for it. I mean, I can finally cut this off my arm. Yay! Oh, it's a different one, it's nice and blue. Normally they were like one solid color, but it's nice. Um, a lot of people complimented me on my makeup, so thank you to those people who did. Um, my mask managed to hold in place. I stuck fashion tape to it because it was falling apart. Um, my hair got stuck to it, and trying to put my wig on this morning was hell. That's why, like, half my hair is showing. It doesn't help that my hair's got glue in it and um, eyeshadow to make it look black. So that's fun. <laughs> um, I can't feel up here. Because the glue, glue is stuck to my face and the mask, so I can't feel my upper face. And my lower face, I can't feel because of the awkward smiling I did. I was like, hmm, hmm, hmm. It was like so painful. I'm like, I can't feel my face. Like, how do people do this? I can't feel my face. Um, CB Studios came up to me. He came in and up to me. He's like, LA Cosplay. I'm like, yes. He goes, you're awesome. I'm like, holy crap. Like, CB Studios came running up to me telling me I'm awesome. Like, dude, I'm normally telling you you're awesome. I'm normally showing the crap out of your stuff. And you said hi to me. And you acknowledged my costume. And you've commented on my Facebook. Like, thank you, man. It meant a lot. Um... But yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, I didn't really do much. I mostly just wandered around a lot, which was so boring. Uh, when you go on the convention hall once, you don't need to go on it again. Um, but I did go on it a lot. And I was like, oh, why am I in here? But you know, whatever. Um, I also went to the cosplay competition panel. Um, cosplay competition, which was actually really interesting. For some reason, there was hardly any Love Live skits. Yes, thank you. I'm sorry, but to me, personally, to the untrained eye, to the untrained anime fan, because I really don't care for anime. Like, no offense, but I think there's a difference between anime and animation. Anyway, but I don't really care for anime, so every single act being Love Live, dance, troupe, whatever, please just Get your own competition. I'm sick of you watching years. Like, no offense, but when every single act, or every second act, whatever, is a Love Live dance group, it's like, oh my god, I am not sitting here watching you. I'm sorry. You're great. Your costumes are amazing. You look cute. But the group before you kind of did a similar routine, and I'm not really interested. And the soundtrack sounds the same. So move on, please. But today was different. The... The cosplay competition only went for like half an hour, I think, 
I'm gonna be an hour. And it was really short. I was like, holy crap, you went through everybody. And I only had to record once. Actually, not to lie, I had to record twice. The first one went for like 35 minutes, and the second one only went for 10 minutes. So I was like, holy crap. And then I did a third video, which was just the winners, and that went for like five minutes. I was like, really? Like 45 minutes? Wow. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> so that was interesting. Um, so that was actually fun to watch because there wasn't that many dance skits. There was a variety of skits and a couple of different variety of cosplayers entered. So that was really fun and interesting. So that was really good to watch. So thank you for making that fun today. I watched John Barrowman's panel. <gasps> Yay! Oh my god, he came out as Wonder Woman! Or as he said, Wonder Man. But, and in the back of his outfit said JB and he's like if you're dyslexic you can reverse that and you know what it means BJ <laughs> I'm not going there <laughs> and he revealed that he likes taking it from behind but that's a whole other debate he also admitted that he's peed in Prince Charles garden and he stole Prince Charles glass like drinking glass and if you don't know who I'm talking about, it's like Prince Charles, you know, the Royal Highness Prince Charles. Yeah, the Royal Family. Yeah, apparently John Barrowman's met him and peed in his bushes and stole his glasses. So that was a nice, interesting story to listen to. And then he also told us a story about how he thought he was going to get murdered in the back of an Uber. <laughs> I was like, dude. And then he had the poor bugger. He got confused because also he and his sister went out partying and drunk. Like, because that's what you do when you're 50-something years old. Not many people in their, like, 50s go out partying. My mum's 40, and she hasn't go out partying. Mind you, she's got four kids to raise, <laughs> and John doesn't. <laughs> I don't mean that in a mean way, I just mean my mum would, whatever. I say mean, I'm sorry. Um, anyway, so he was saying that he booked, his, he and his sister booked an Uber, and it, they got their Uber thing wrong, and they thought, the Uber driver thought he was going for like a two hour drive to Texas, Paris. Which I didn't know there was a Paris in Texas. Mind you, I didn't know there was a Brisbane in another side of the world, so that's how much I pay attention to geography. I didn't listen in class. <laughs> um, and then he thought he was going to get murdered, and he, his sister shouted out, You're not going to get bloody murdered by the Uber driver! And the Uber driver was like, uh, <laughs> Yeah, so that was fun. His panel was really interesting. He, he does his panels very differently. Normally when they do panels, they just talk and talk and it's like okay we're here we're here listening to you like your stories are great and um, we weren't allowed to record so that was fine which is a bit disappointing but you <sighs> know play by the rules so i can come back <laughs> oh. um but he he gave up he like said to men stuff for like 10 minutes and he's like you know what guys ask me questions there's a whole reason i'm here so you guys can ask me questions he revealed that he knew he was the face of Bo, and he apparently um, he was watching the episode with David Tennant, and when the episode aired, they were just about to come up to the scene, John Barman opened the window and stood next to the window, and David's like, what are you doing? And John's like, I'm waiting for everyone's gaps. And he heard it, and then he turned around to David Tennant, he's like, I right, there you go! Because, you know, we were all shocked about the face of Bo reveal, even I still am. And I was like, no, that can't be ja ja um, Captain Jack Harkness. Like, no, 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 no. But it turns out that is the face of Bo. Yes. So that's really interesting and lovely to find out. Um, I mean, we already knew that anyway. It's been a spoiler alert for like, how long? Um, so if you didn't know that, sorry, I really am. Um, hmm, what else? So yeah, I just saw the Cosplay Comp and the John Bowman panel. Today was a pretty boring day, um, so I was like, oh my god, I really want to go home. <laughs> I'm so bored and I feel like I'm dying. But like I said, I got some photos with random people, so hopefully I get them back. I probably won't, but thank you anyway. Um, I don't know what else to say. These videos are getting shorter and shorter, aren't they? Probably a good thing, probably a bad thing. But either way, who cares, right? Whether you sit through them or not, it's a different story. Hmm. Um... But yeah, tomorrow's back to reality, and then Tuesday's back to work. 6 a.m. shift, 4 hours. Yay, work. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to leave it at that, because otherwise I'm just going to prolong this video, and nobody likes when I procrastinate. Actually, I don't like when I procrastinate, because that's fun. And now I'm going to have the fun job of getting all this off. It was a struggle. Oh, 
No, hold on. Let's see if I can get half of this off. Last night was actually really fun because the mask was barely hanging onto my face, so I just ripped it off after I made the video. Come on, bobby pin. I have like bobby pins through bobby pins, and I don't know what. Ah, any of them. Ah. There's one there. There's another one here. Ah! Uh, oh. Oh. Well, this morning I actually had a freak out thinking I broke my wig. I was like, no. Um, because it has like these little clippy things, which I don't know how to use. You know those little clippy things? I haven't quite mastered out how to use them. So when I was trying to do my wig, I couldn't figure it out until I snapped them. So I was like, a uh, screw it. Um, but if you're wondering, um, my wig is bought from eBay. Um, I can't remember which user. If I figure it out, I'll tell you. But it's black and green meshed together, which is awesome because I spent forever trying to buy a half wig that was half black and half green. Because I was like, I'll base my costume around the wig. I only realized there's uh, the only wigs that I like, the one I was after, was either light green, which was like a, um, um, like a, like a sea foam. And I didn't know what sea foam was. Because I'm not a painter. I don't know my colours, okay? I only know the basic principles. Okay? Yeah. So, it was seafoam one side and black the other. And I was like, what the hell? Um, and that was going to cost like $200 with the, just a wig. And then it was like an extra couple of hundred for the f shipping. I was like, no, screw you guys. So, eBay was the best. It was like $20, which is how much I would normally pay in a costume shop or at a local shop. $20 for a wig. And then it was like... Um, three dollars or something like it was under ten dollars for shipping and I was like oh yeah that's a total of what I would pay at the shops so thank you eBay even though I don't like online shopping thank you so it's really cool it's actually really bright so the way you see it in the camera is how you see it in person so it's really awesome uh, so I liked it and it was awesome because one side was like at the front mostly black and the other side was mostly green and then it's all mixed together so that was really cool um, oh my god I can breathe now last night I made, yesterday I made the mistake of um, not eating and not drinking I think I had 750 meals of water yesterday and I had only eaten at 6am and that was breakfast and I ended up feeling really sick last night and I went to bed like at 7 p.m. I was like, I can't do this. And I was struggling to make it through the day. I was like, I need to be here because I want to go do autographs and photos. And I was like, I can't do this. I feel like crap. Um, but yeah. Um, but I made the. I learned from my lesson and I actually ate and I drank. Um, so that was awesome. So I'm just kind of starting to unravel here. <laughs> So I can go get some food, I'm starving. I've had breakfast and then I've been snacking on apples all day today. So that was okay, considering I don't normally eat fruit. Well, I do eat fruit, but I don't normally eat apples. I don't like apples. I like strawberries. Berries are nice. Yeah, so I'm gonna quickly do this and then I'm gonna go. And then you all go comment and be like, what the fuck? And I'll be like, yeah. Do the oh, there's another bobby pin. Ah. Look better now. Ah. <laughs> That's what a man and man want to say before they die. Ah. Um, okay, so I'm going to go now. Um, that was like too long of a video because it's stretching out. Um, I don't know when I'm going to next cosplay at a convention. I know my next cosplay thing will be on Friday. I think it's the 4th of May and that's part of the Starlight Foundation. So that's pretty cool. Uh, oh, I can't move my face. Um, but I think the next convention would probably be in like September or November when everything else is on. Um, but whether I attend them or not. I'm finding that I keep running out of money, which is a bad thing when you want a hobby like this. So, <laughs> so um, yeah, I gotta convince my boss to give me more money. Which doesn't help because I keep asking for days off. <laughs> uh, no wonder I hate my job. <laughs> I probably shouldn't say that. Mind you, they know I hate it. And I'm still there. <sighs> Lesson to learn. Don't stay at a job you hate. Even if you need money. 
go find a new job. I gotta do that. That's fun. I hate job hunting. Anyway, so I've procrastinated and I've prolonged this video as long as possible and I don't know why, so I'm really sorry. Um, but I'm gonna go now. Yay! Finally! And I will see you guys whenever, whether it be a next video or another cosplay thing. So, mwah! Bye! <laughs>